It's 2025 and as a web developer, you are standing at a crossroad. Two paths lie ahead of you. One leads to React and others to Angular. Both are powerful, both are popular. But which one is right for you? Both are incredible tools, but they cater to different needs. Let's compare them across five key areas. By the end of this video, you will have a clear answer. You are starting a project. You want to get up and run faster. Which frameworks makes your life easier? React backed by Meta is like a playground for JavaScript developer. If you already know JavaScript, pick up React. It's minimalist, just a library, not a full framework. So you can start small and scale up as needed. Angular, on the other hand, is a complete package. Built by Google, it's a full-fledged framework with everything needed. Routing, state management, form handling, and many more. But here's the catch. It has a steeper learning curve. You need to grasp decorators, TypeScript, and concepts like dependency injection. If you are a beginner or want quick development, React is the best bet. But if you prefer structure, don't mind a learning challenge, Angular is the oath mastering. Alright, now let's talk about development style. Are you someone who loves the freedom to choose your own tools? Or do you prefer all-in-one framework that handles everything for you? With React, you decide how to handle routing, state management, and backend integration. You can mix and match tools like Redux and Next.js. Angular like a Swiss army knife. It comes fully equipped with built-in solutions. No need to figure out what tool to use. Angular provides everything right out of the box, making it ideal for long-term and enterprise projects. React's flexibility makes it great for startups and solo developers. Angular structure ensures consistency for big enterprise and long-term projects. Performance is crucial. Nobody likes slow apps, right? React's virtual DOM makes it super efficient for updates and rendering. It is lightweight and fast, perfect for highly interactive apps. Angular, with its real DOM and powerful change detection, is built for large-scale applications. It's rock-solid for enterprise-level projects where stability is the key. For smaller high-performance apps, React has the age. But for massive, complex applications, Angular is unbeatable. Popularity matters because a big community means more job opportunities, third-party libraries, and faster problem solving. React has consistently dominated the front-end world. In 2025, it's still the most popular library with a massive ecosystem that includes tools like Redux, Next.js, and React Native for mobile development. Its community is huge and it's used by the big names like Facebook, Instagram, and Netflix. Angular also has a strong ecosystem with tools like Angular Material and Ionic. While its community is smaller, it's highly active and well supported by Google. It is a go to choice for large corporations like Google and Microsoft. React still dominates in the popularity, but Angular continues to shine in enterprise and corporate environments. Alright, let's talk about what really matters jobs and salaries. In 2025, where you can earn more as a developer. React has a higher demand in startups and tech companies. As a React developer, you can easily earn between 90k to 150k per year. Plus, there are tons of freelance and contact-based opportunities. Angular is preferred by corporate and enterprise-level companies. Angular developers can earn between 85k to 140k per year with more stability and long-term project. If you want flexibility, freelancing, or startup jobs, React wins. But if you are looking for stability and corporate environments, Angular is a solid choice. Alright, it's the decision time. If you want quick development and flexibility, if you prefer working with massive community, if you are interested in startups, open source, or AI-driven projects, pick React. On the other hand, if you want full-fledged framework with built-in solution, if you prefer structured, scalable applications, if you are targeting corporate or enterprise-level job, then pick Angular. But what do you think? Which one you will choose? Angular or React? Drop your thought in the comment below. I will see you in the next video.